Well, let's get some reaction to this now from Afghanistan's point of view. Dr. Zahir Tanen is Afghanistan's ambassador to the United Nations. Ambassador Tanen, thank you for being with us. As this report points out, it cites a failure on the part of the Afghan government to really stem the rise of the Taliban. How would you portray your government's efforts to stop the Taliban? Well, uh, uh, there's no doubt that there's an uh, unprecedented increase in the activities of the Taliban, a surge in violence, and an and attempt by the Taliban and al-Qaeda uh, to deteriorate this, uh, the security situation in some parts of the country. Uh, the response to the Taliban is a collective effort. Uh, our forces with uh, our allies, the NATO forces, uh, work together to stop uh, the, the Taliban, their advances. But I don't think it's right that the Taliban are challenging uh, the, the peace in Afghanistan. They are disturbing the process in Afghanistan. And I'm sure we are able to, to, uh, to uh, prevent uh, the attempts that they would like to make. Well, this report goes on to cite what it calls rampant corruption in the administration of President Hamid Karzai. How would you defend such a claim? In the report, uh, they speak about uh, a variety of reasons for the de deterioration of the situation, including corruption. Uh, corruption is an issue. It is not only a dom domestic issue in Afghanistan. It is an issue that uh, both the government of Afghanistan and the international community should address together in Afghanistan. And it is not, only, uh, it is, uh, not limited to, to, to one part of, of the efforts in Afghanistan. Uh, the government of Afghanistan uh, uh, has developed a strategy and in, in, in embarked on measures uh, to curb the, the corruption. Uh, but I think uh, the main issue is that how to have the trust of people uh, combating uh, corruption, but also uh, strengthening the governments and addressing the need of people. Let me just ask you in the few seconds we have left. Uh, Secretary of Defense Gates has asked for more troops to be brought to Afghanistan, both from NATO and from the U.S. Do you think that's the solution? Uh, the military response to the increased uh, activities of the terrorists is one of the important elements of a complex uh, response. We need to stop uh, the, the Taliban, the terrorists. But at the same time, we also need to win the trust and confidence of people. It is about a comprehensive approach, military and non-military measures together. Ambassador Tannen, thank you very much for talking to us today. Thank you.